Uh, doctor, so what's going on? There's a telescope that's going to prove God. Can, can you tell us what's going on? Are you going to be able to prove God with this new telescope? What's happening? Well, my son is a space scientist. Mm -hmm. He's actually a rocket scientist. Mm -hmm. A nice Jewish career. Go on. Right. So he, he, he didn't like the sight of blood. So he became a rocket scientist, and he works for NASA, and he works on the space telescopes that mm -hmm. go up uh, and are sending back amazing information. You've heard of the Hubble, and the next one was the Webb, and the one that's going to be launched in a year and a half is called the Nancy Grace Roman Telescope, which is going to be 100 times more information than in the uh, previous ones, mm -hmm. is they can look all the way back to within a few moments of creation. Ooh. They're actually seeing things that occurred 15 billion years ago. Uh -huh. uh, they need a half a billion dollars. Okay, no problem. How about this? You don't have to search for God. God exists. I know for a fact. Now just take the half a billion, donate it to Chabad, and we're gonna, it's, every, all the problems go away. Well, the question is, are they looking for God? But they're looking for the creation of the universe. The question, of course, that always comes up, then what happened before the moment of creation? Right. Uh, it, it, there must be something else out there. because right. it, it. Well, we call that God. And we, and we don't understand. That's above our understanding. G-O-D. Whatever it is.